this, oh, I'm sorry. This is the Mill River. This is the Mill River. So this is the upper mill. Yeah. The portion is called the upper mill. Starts way up in Monroe as a little yeah. groundwater swelling. Flows down into the Eastern Reservoir. Comes out the bottom of the Eastern Reservoir Dam, which is right yeah. up here. Um, this was purchased by the land trust in, I think, around 92. The reason this water is so important and so special, it's actually designated as a class one wild trout management stream in the state. There's only nine of them throughout the state. Land Trust has two. And the Land Trust has two of those, the only two in Fairfield County, I believe. So the, re the reason it's that, it's that designation is this is all wild fish here. So there's no stocking. It's a population of uh, wild brook trout and brown trout that are completely naturally reproducing. Uh, the reason that it works out that way is because there's a dam, the Eastern Reservoir is about a mile and a half upriver from here. It's a tailwater dam, what's known as a tailwater, meaning the water comes out underneath it, so it stays cold all year long. And that's really the critical thing for trout, particularly wild brook trout. Once the temperature gets to that 70 degrees, trout are just going to fry. So a lot of these other local rivers, by the time you get into the summer, it's completely cooked and the trout are all dead, and then it becomes a warm water fishery, bass, you know, panfish, that kind of thing.